Hey guys, welcome back. Today our recipe at homemade flavors is instant rice makku without grinding wet rice flour. This crispy, crunchy murku are simple and easy and can be made in just 20 minutes that too with store bought dry rice flour. To start with, measure 2 and 1/2 cups of rice flour. Rice flour here I'm using is a store bought dry rice flour. So, I measure 2 and 1/2 cups and transfer to a mixing bowl. And to this, I added two tablespoons of white sesame seeds, salt as per taste, and one teaspoon of red chili powder, and two tablespoons of butter at room temperature. Here, I measured half cup of fried gram or fried chickpea or chana dal and transferred to a mixer jar. And I made this into fine and smooth powder. And I'm transferring to this bowl. Here, after adding all the ingredients, I'm mixing this very well. so that butter salt and red chili powder gets mixed up with the flour once all the ingredients are mixed well now here i'm adding water gradually and i'm mixing because gradual adding of water helps in knowing the correct consistency of the dough here our dough is ready and it should be soft like this now here you can see i'm taking this star shaped plate and fixing this smurku maker Once it is fixed tightly, here I am greasing this with little amount of oil. Now here I am taking handful of dough and I am transferring this dough to the murku maker. We need to fill three fourth of this murku maker with the dough, not completely. After placing the dough inside the murku maker, now close with the lid and secure it tightly. Now here I took a butter paper and I am piping the murku onto the butter paper. This way it will be easy to make all the murku on the butter paper initially and after piping one batch of murku like this onto the butter paper carefully transfer each murku into the oil that has heated this is a very time saving because by the time oil is heated up here we piped all the murku onto the butter paper and we are transferring all the murku into the oil at a time and by the time these murku are being fried we can pipe the second batch of murku onto the butter paper after transferring murku into oil oil should be in the medium heat and do not disturb the murku until the bubbles in the oil settles down here you can see all the bubbles are settled down so i'm flipping these murku to the other side and allowing them to fry flip each and every murku to the other side and allow them to fry on medium heat Once the murku are well fried on both sides, transfer them to a strainer and strain the excess oil in case if any. After straining the excess oil, transfer to your tissue paper and continue the process with the next batch. With this crispy, crunchy instant rice murku without grinding wet rice flour is ready in just 20 minutes. Here you can see how crispy and crunchy this murku are. So friends try making this instant murku and do let me know in the comment section. If you like this recipe please consider subscribing to homemade flavors and press the bell icon for more interesting recipes. This is Rupa signing off for today and see you in the next video. Thank you.